This location is already an incredible economic driver for Howard County. And while we could ride comfortably on the past and present successes of Gateway, along with its premier location in the I-95 corridor, I agree that with a new, bold vision, Columbia Gateway could become the top center for innovation in the state of Maryland. That is why I'm here to announce my vision to transform Columbia Gateway into an innovation district for Howard County. It will be here that fast-growing companies will be able to partner and learn from established industry leaders along with anchor research and education institutions. This collaboration amongst businesses will help to create a dynamic and vibrant community here in Gateway, a community that will benefit all of Howard County, the state of Maryland, and will help to attract and retain top talent. Over the next year, the Howard County Economic Development Authority will work with the property owners and businesses located in Columbia Gateway to create programming and opportunities to collaborate with one another. This will be a key effort to create connections within the community of Gateway. We will also be launching more organized community programming here, here such as professional networking and training sessions, running and biking races, outdoor concerts and happy hours, and food truck rallies, all with the purpose of bringing people together to create a collaborative community right here in Gateway. I lived in Howard County all my life. Uh, Gay has been here about, I feel like, all my life. And it was right when it was built. And it was the way things were going when we did it. But times have changed. And every single business owner I see here who I've met with and talked to said we need to redevelop Gateway to make it this master engine, economic engine that it can be. And there's just so much potential right here. Uh, being so close to I-95 and be part of the 108, 175, I-95 Route 1 corridor, we can make this thing not so much just a Howard County jewel, but as I've told the Governor, as I've told the Secretary of Transportation, I've told Mike Gill, our Secretary of Commerce, this could be the major economic growth engine for all of Central Maryland and Maryland in general. So this is an opportunity we can't lose. And it's going to take some time. People might remember, I think someone just told me, it's the 10-year anniversary of the plan for downtown Columbia, just the starting of working on it. Uh, it's been seven years since the actual first plan was signed. It takes a while. And so we can't say, okay, let's finish doing other things, then we'll come back and go to Gateway. No, we can, we can multitask. I think someone said to me earlier, I think it was Bill, you know, we can chew and walk at the same time. You know, we can focus on downtown Columbia to make sure things are going right there, to make sure things are happening there, but we can also focus on Gateway. And I want everybody here to know and everybody in Howard County to know that that's a chief priority of our administration, the Economic Development Authority, is to make sure the Gateway is going to be something special in the future.